Miguel and here, welcome to Torchlight 1. So I'm recording using the NVIDIA Shadowplay recorder for offline recording, but I'm also streaming for the first time using Steam. So I don't know if my voice works with Steam or not, but if that's the case, and it doesn't work, then, then it will still work on NVIDIA Shadowplay recorder, which means I will still be able to upload the video to YouTube. Uh, but, of course, it won't work in the, Steam, uh, in the stream. On Steam, uh, so we'll see later if the, if the voice works or not. And the sound, I know that the video works. You can see here it works. But I don't know about the. Uh hello, hello. I think maybe my microphone isn't plugged in for streaming. Alright, Mr. Neven here. I don't know if, if the stream actually works. We will... Hello, uh Mr. Neven. It won. So I mean, it actually works using the Good. Media Shadowplay recorder for offline. Alright, then we know it works. Perfect. And then we will... Uh, Check, this is a modded version of Torchlight 1, so we have a bunch of custom characters, these are the three original characters. The Destroyer, the Vanquisher, of course she's modded, she's blonde in this uh, game, normally she is black. I'm using a mod that has changed her hair color. Okay, then we have the Alchemist, and then we have some modded characters. We have the Airbender. So I said most of the custom characters have the same models as the three characters of the original game, used with different skill trees and different looks, like different textures and such. Okay. Assassin, Barbarian. Then we have a Demonologist, pretty cool, unique skin. Then an Enchanter. Executioner and then uh, yeah we check them. <coughs> then we have the Fomar, no idea what, what that is. We have the Führer. Okay, we need to move back. So, so this is the one I should select. Then we have the Guardian. Gunblade, Ice Queen, Kensai, the only unique model, the Lady Knight, and we have the Nether, Ma Nether Mage, Paladin, Shaman, Spirit Dancer. Sorceress using a model that looks kind of like the W2 Sorceress. We have the Stone Brother, the Valkyria, the War Mage, and the Warlock. Okay, then we have a bunch of different pets we can choose from too. See, in the original game, you only had two different pets you had a cat. You had a dog. They are vanilla pets that you can choose from. In this uh, mod, we can pick a bunch of different creatures, like the Aloe Gal, the Arctic Tiger, Bengal Tiger, Black Tiger, Burrower, Cave Flyer, Construct, Corrupted Merc, the Disciple. The dog, no, that's the vanilla one. The dragon spawn, electric elemental, ember colossus, ferret, okay. fire elemental, gel, ghost, goblin, horse, ice elemental, imaginary, crag, lich. Mech Construct, 
mimic crawler the mimic the order rack the face beast poison elemental pygmy the rat man the skeleton the spider the troll to Tara, under dwarf, Vercolin, the vile bracken, the white tiger, the wisp, like in Warcraft 3, the sealet, and the zombie. Alright, I already had three characters created in this game. The best one is this one, level 12. She's about to embark on Act 3. Then I have two other characters that, that finish the first act, the sorcerers and the uh, Shandiak character using the Lady Knight class, with the unique model. So these two have finished the first act and the uh, character Vale using the same name as the Anila character of the first game. She is <coughs> level 12 is twice the strength of the other two and she has finished act two as well. Okay, we can start the game. Let's fail. I lost play this character I believe in 2021. Okay. Back then she wasn't modified. I played her modified too I believe. But uh, the videos new to pass the unmodified character because I managed to corrupt the game and then had to start a lower and I didn't record when I played the first act and the second act so I never recorded when I played with this blonde character but I did record when I played with Vanilla one let's see if it's still recording yeah it is okay good it's been a while since I played uh, zoom out like this so it's like Diablo 2 this game more like Diablo 2 than Diablo 3 made by some of the same creators too oh ruins. I've read of them this is Etheria their discoveries are the foundation of my art oh, I wish Brink could see this All right. I have reactivated these three room gates, but it is the fourth that leads deeper. Some threat must have caused the Assyrians to disable it. The destination glyphs are missing. We'll need to find those missing glyphs to continue. Search the active gates while I study this chamber. Hurry, there are many obstacles between us and the Ember Forge below. Alright, I will accept the quest. quest. Okay, complete. Hatch. Hatch has opened a portal in town. He wants you to go through and retrieve a carved onyx gargoyle from the other side. Shimmering deep, incomplete. Vastman has asked you to find a place of shimmering ember in an area filled with water. Quest of glory, incomplete. Trill wants you to, to slay Earthbreaker, the ageless, on floor 10, <coughs> so that he can compose a song about the battle Styrian remnants incomplete <coughs> three of the three destination glyphs one from each rune gate with the glyphs seal will be able to open up the final rune, po rune gate okay. this character has the normal dog pet because I play this as the vanilla Vanquisher class. So I wanted her to, to have a normal pet and normal looks, but when I had to replay everything, I decided to mod the game, and she ended up with uh, blonde hair instead of black hair. Otherwise, it's the vanilla class, the Vanquisher, the vanilla dog. I need it. Oh shit! He died already. Can resurrect there. 
no idea why he died and he been on twice as if he died. Ah, these are our zombies. Yes, we have potions on one, button 1, man on button 2, so it's 3 and 4 we need to use. The fuck? This place is actually di no, di difficult. Yeah, maybe too difficult. Okay, this was just a test anyway. We'll try a different game. See you later, bye.